Hey loves, Pray, always remember to trust in God, give him your um, concerns and everything else you're worried about because he will always come through for you no matter what. Um, yeah, he, he's very concerned in how you're feeling. God cares for you. He loves you. He wants you to be happy. God never wants you upset. So if you're feeling down today or you feel like, you know, just like everything just going left for you, um, I pray for you to see better days and, you know, um, get the healing and comfort that you need. Know that I am here for you um, and that I care for you as well. Because I feel like we all should be happy. Of course, we're going to have bad days. But, you know, we still want to be happy. We want to have some good days, too. Um, sadness is just temporary. You know, you can't you can't let the devil trick you and let you think that your sadness will be forever. Because it's not so. If your sadness was forever, then that would be a good thing. So that's why you can go find in God and talk to God about your concerns because he cares for you. I care for you. And God always wants us to be happy each and every day. So God will come and help you when the time is right. God always comes and helps his um, children that need him, that call upon him. So... I got a Bible verse today. Um, it actually was at 7.20 this morning. I was asleep, though, but I, I still had it popped up on my phone. But basically, it reads, Praise praise be the God and Father of our um, Lord, Jesus Christ, and His, and His great mercy. He has, he has given us new birth into a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus from the dead so God has given us hope and he reminds us that Jesus is real that Jesus rose on the third day those who do not know Jesus got up the third day with all power and he got up so if Jesus can get up you can get up too don't let sadness overtake your life and know that things will get better um Sometimes we just don't see, like, things getting better, but we have to trust in that process that it will get better because God is here for us and he loves us and he just wants us to be happy. He put us on earth for a reason. He didn't put us down here to be sad all the time and, you know, be heartbroken and upset. God is not of sadness. God is of happiness. And he's looking down at you now. And I know you're probably crying and it's okay to cry, but just know that you won't cry forever. Um, God is there with you, and he will come to you in your very need of time. In your, in your need of time, God will come for you. I don't know why I mess it up. Probably because I'm a little sleepy. It could be in my room. It's like a little toasty. It's like a little, it feel good in here. So it's like a little toasty over there. I turn my heat on because I got cold. But yes, yeah, it's a little toasty in here. And it's, it's a really late night vlog. I was just, you know, doing a check in with you guys, telling you guys that God is great. He's listening. Um, and God loves you. At the end of the day, despite of what's going on or what you did. God loves you, so just always know that and have hope in Him because God has hope in you. God will forever continue to be on your on your side, and He will lead your path as long as you let Him direct your path and your steps in life. Um, so I, I'm going to say a quick prayer over you guys, and I'm going to pray for myself, and I'm going to pray for my family. So... Father God, I come to you and I ask you to uplift every subscriber that's on my channel, Father God. I pray that you heal them in the ways that they don't talk about, Father God. I pray that you heal me.
Father God, and I pray for my sister, Father God. I pray that you help her feel better too as well, Father God. And I just pray that you touch every soul that's connected with my YouTube channel, Father God. You touch their souls and you let them know that sadness is not of you. And that that sadness is temporary. That healing is coming on the way. Deliverance is coming on the way. And you've always been here for us, even though we cannot always see we know that you are always there for us, Father God, and we just want to say thank you for everything you've done for us and everything you're getting ready to do for us, Father God. We're sorry if we don't talk to you enough, Father God. We're sorry if we don't hear you enough, Father God, as we should, but we want you to know that we love you and that we will try to be better tomorrow than we were today, Father God. We promise to do right by you and always right by you. We promise to come to you first, not come to you last. So I just pray that everyone that everyone feels better. That's watching this this video. I hope they feel better with whatever they going through, Father God. And I just hope that they get through whatever it is. And I pray for myself that I see better days. And I pray for my subscribers to see better days and my family to see better days. In your son Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. You know how you're praying and then you just pray for a lot of stuff. And then it's like, I don't know, you just don't want to feel like you messing up enough. So you just go back and pray again. You be like, oh, I forget. Like, I was supposed to pray for this. Or I was supposed to do this and that. You know, you just, I don't know, you just have a lot to pray about. Like, I don't know, is that just me or is that y'all? But I'm in the block here. I hope that you guys find comfort in this video and I hope that this prayer help you and always remember to pray for yourself and continue to pray every day I love you guys and good night good morning because it's now two o'clock in the morning but yeah hope you guys have a nice sleep and a great day tomorrow and stay positive bye loves